I can, if I want to show something I'm doing for Los Angeles, I cannot show this in Venice because I don't have the Venetian sky, I don't have the Los Angeles sky. Uh, most of all. So I have to find a way to ground it here to this exhibition and create an atmosphere which would be understand, understood in this dark space. So there's a common thing is these uh, textiles because they're really Los Angeles textiles but they come actually from the designers in Los Angeles but they come from India and so on. So I think they have a lot to do with this Venetian textiles coming in from the Silk Road sometime and so on. And then the museum, the, the, the piece is dark and in the dark you have gold floor and so on. So, so it's a little bit playful. So if, if I look in I think there could be a Venetian mask coming around the corner or something. So, because I want to see this, the atmosphere. For me, the atmosphere is important, right? I have with every building, there's a new challenge. They're in Norway or Korea or in Los Angeles. So getting to know the people, getting to know the place, trying to reach to make the building fit to the surrounding, but this is not, to the place, this is not so difficult for me, but more to get to know the people, what do they think, what do they want, and to build up a structure to make a high quality building, because there are no excuses. Of course, from, I think this is the greatest compliment <laughs> if like your grandchildren would see a building by me, they wouldn't know my name, nothing. They would look at this building and say, look at this, great. this is a great building, I love it. Can you imagine a bigger compliment? So, that's it.